you caught a glimpse of you while you were wrapped in a blanket sheltered with her love as you cradled in her arms, beginning to find the sunshine in this world. Before you even opened your eyes, you heard mom's gentle lullabies that promised to protect you with the fruits of her love. We were all little seeds as we emerged out of trees, but before we made our roots, stems, and leaves, we began by choking on hiccups and blowing raspberries while dad captured our candid Kodak memories of promising first footsteps with wobbling knees. Then came the first bike ride and you still had mom on your side while you tried to hide your fear under that helmet. But she smiled, held your shoulder and said, son, it's about time you let go of your training wheels. And at that, she pushed away her little seed and watched it fall headfirst onto the soft ground because she knew that in the seed was a voice waiting to be found. So little seeds began by sprouting little roots, brightening the world up with light up Velcro boots, wearing them and going on pursuits of happiness with no absolute so seeds turned into seedlings buried under the dreams and expectations of reaching seedlings but soon these seedlings began to realize that the dreams they once dreamed were a bit too supersized and that this world they tried to grow in comprised of big bad wolves that mom read about in storybooks and then they were told that self-esteem came with good looks and the answers to life were found through flipping textbooks but in the midst of being stuck in all this mud little seedlings started to sprout their buds because they began to find direction as they surrendered their imperfections. This is the world that gives more than it takes and it gives a voice to each seed that's raked and through every slip and fall, they found ways to stand tall. With their humility kept high and their pride kept low, they emerged from the ground below and that is how little seedlings learned to grow.